A man in Lake Cowichan is under investigation by the RCMP after a dog was shot and killed outside his home. He says he was inside fast asleep when there was a commotion outside that woke him up. When he looked out his window, he says he saw his friend in trouble. The CTV's Jet Bazzi shows us tonight he grabbed his gun, but he says he has no regrets. A vet examines Ken Campbell's dog, Max. He's been wounded in a dog fight. Three mastiffs and a pit bull cross, and they start attacking my dog. Early Thursday morning, Ken was walking his dogs, Max and Bob, along this stretch of Cowichan Lake Road. All of a sudden, they were attacked by a pack of dogs. Two mastiffs on one on each side of the back of my dog, and the pit bull was on the throat and the passenger side of his head, and he's getting chewed. I reached behind the, behind the pit bull under his throat, and I'm giving him the RCMP chokehold. Ken says he tried to restrain the pit bull. I'm holding and holding, and, and that dog tips his head up, and he gets loose. Well, if I'm trying to kill him, for those couple seconds, I was pretty freaked out, thinking he was going to turn on me. The pit bull escaped Ken's grasp and attacked Bob. And all three of them now, the two mastiffs, the two golden mastiffs, or whatever they are, uh, follow the pit bull and attack that little black dog right there on the, on the throat. And as soon as that happened, I hear crack. That sound was a rifle firing. As far as I was concerned, it looked to me like he was getting eaten alive. Wally says the commotion outside his home woke him up. When he looked outside, he saw his friend being attacked and says he came to his rescue. I grabbed my gun and I went and dispatched one of those dogs. And that was the end of the fight. Instantly. Instantly over. RCMP believe the dogs escaped from their owner's yard. They are now investigating the shooting. We do a full investigation on uh, complaints that come into our office and uh, that's our procedure. If we believe that there may be a charge, uh, then we would uh, would seek that. Wally believes he did the right thing. I did what I thought I had to do to save somebody's life. Uh, as far as I'm concerned, a human life is worth more than a dog's life. Ken says he's glad Wally fired the shot. The dog fight was getting out of control. Wally saved me as far as I'm concerned. Not just my dog, but me. He was the only one who came up to help. Max is recovering. He has four puncture wounds on his body and is on antibiotics. The owner of the dog that was killed has not commented on the incident. Jeff Bassey, CTV News, Lake Cowichan.